I think for the Dutch, it's a kind of secular Madonna. She stands there in a monumental way, pouring out milk and in an everyday life scene. But so that's one side. The cultural importance it has, it is fantastically well preserved. So every brushstroke for me set is still visible. And it is the illusion he creates of us really looking in a, through a window to the 17th century, which is fantastically well orchestrated. I mean, he's, he's like a film director. He, every little bit is in the right place. The light is treated in the most amazing way. Um, the way he, for example, depicts the reflection of light on the bread and the crumbliness of the bread and the flour that's on the outside of a loaf of bread, the different colours of the skirt of her dress that she's wearing, but above all, her concentration. We're like a voyeur looking at her. She's not aware that we look at her because she's entirely concentrated on pouring out the milk. And what I always say is it's, it is the, also the painting with the most beautiful plaster wall ever painted. If you look at the background, this plaster wall behind her with the little nails and even the nails have a little bit of rust around them in the wall and the dust of the whitewashed wall on the floor and every detail in that wall is vivid. So it's really a vibrant painting in every sense. And I think that a painting gives you the, the space of mind to actually think. I think that that's what great art does. It, it, it gives you the, 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 the possibility to let your imagination work.